بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سٹوڈنٹس آرمی پبلک سکول اینڈ کالج زمزمان و شہرہ کین کلاس ٹین ویک الیون چپٹر نمبر سیون سبجک میتمیٹکس پریپیرڈ بائی مسٹر زفر خٹک ٹیکس بک میتمیٹکس ٹین سائنس گروپ پیج نمبر ون ہنڈرڈ این فیفٹی ٹو ایکسرسائز سیون پوائنٹ ٹو ٹاپک انٹروڈکشن ٹو ٹرگنومیٹری Resources required textbook. Objectives. Establish the rule L is equal to R theta, where R is the radius of the circle, L is the length of the circular arc, and theta the central angle measure in radians. Number two, prove that the area of a sector of a circle is 1 by 2 R square theta. Unit 7, Introduction to Trigonometry. Sector of a circle. The first is a part of the circumference of the circle is called an arc. Number two, a part of the circle bounded by an arc and a chord is called segment of a circle. Number third, a part of the circle bounded by the two radii and an arc is called sector of the circle. So these are the two arc, these are the chord uh, and segments and it is a, a sector and radius R. to establish the rule L is equal to R theta where R is the radius of the circle L is the length of circular arc and theta the central angle measure in radians let an arc AB denoted by L AB arc these two are arc denoted by L substance an angle theta radian at the center of the circle theta is the center of the circle so it is effect of a plane geometry that measure of central angles of the arc of a circle are proportional to the length of their arcs so major angle aob divided by major of angle aoc aob and aoc is equal to ab divided by ac so it means that AOB is the theta and AOC is the one radian. So it means that theta divided by one is equal to L divided by R. So L divided by R is equal to theta or L is equal to R theta. Area of a circular sector. Consider a circle of radius R units and an R of length L units substanding an angle theta 8 O so it is the sector area these are the theta and radii both so angle of a circle is equal to pi r square angle of a circle is equal to 2 pi angle of a sector is equal to pi radian so by elementary geometry we can use the proportion area of a sector a o b p divided by area of a circle so is equal to angle of the sector divided by angle of the circles or area of a sector a o b p divided by area of a circle area of a circle is pi r square is equal to angle of a sector angle of a sector is theta divided by angle of the circle the angle of the circle is 2 pi so pi r square multiply by both sides so it means that area of a sector a o b p is equal to theta divided by 2 pi multiplied by pi r square pi pi r cancel so our answer is 1 by 2 r square theta exercise 7.2 question number one find theta when first part is l is equal to 2 meter and r is equal to 3.5 meter we know that L is equal to R theta. Theta is equal to L by R. So theta is equal to 2 divided by 3.5. L is equal to 2 and R is equal to 3.5. Now theta is equal to 0 0.57 radians. Second part. L is equal to 4.5 meter and R is equal to 2.5 meter. We know that L is equal to R theta. Theta is equal to L by R. So theta is equal to 4.5 divided by 2.5. L is equal to 4.5 and R is equal to 2.5. So 
now theta is equal to 1.8 radi question number 2 find l when theta is equal to 180 degree and r is equal to 4.9 centimeter first theta is equal to 180 degree it will be converted into radian by multiplying pi by 180 180 180 are cancel pi the value of pi is 3.1415 radians we know that l is equal to r theta so putting the value of r in theta r is 4.9 and theta is 3.1415 so after multiplication answer is 15.4 centimeter second part theta is equal to 60 degree 30 minute r is equal to 15 millimeter theta is equal to 60 degree 30 minute so it means that minute will be converted into degree 60 degree plus 30 divided by 60 degree 60 plus 0 0.5 so 60.5 degree now degree converted into radian by multiplying pi by 180 which is 1.056 radians we know that l is equal to r theta l is equal to 15 multiplied by 1.056 radian so it means that the length of is 15.84 millimeter question number three find r when first part is l is equal to four centimeter theta is equal to one by four radian solution we know that l is equal to r theta so r is equal to l by theta r is equal to four divided by one by four so it means that r is equal to four multiplied by one by four so four four r is equal to 16 centimeter second part l is equal to 52 centimeter and theta is equal to 45 degree first theta is equal to 45 degree it will be converted into radian by multiplying pi by 180 so pi by 4 radian so pi by 4 radian means 3.1415 divided by 4 which is 0 0.7854 l is equal to r theta we will find r so r is equal to l by theta r is equal to 52 divided by 7854 r is equal to 66.21 centimeters now question number five in a circle of radius 10 meter find the distance traveled by a point moving on the, this circle if the point makes 3.5 revolution 3.5 revolution means 7 pi so r is equal to 10 same 10 meter which is a radius theta is equal to 3.5 revolution so 3.5 revolution means 7 pi 7 multiply by 3.1415 is equal to 22 radian we know that l is equal to r theta so l is equal to 10 multiplied by 22 so l is equal to 220 meter which is answer question number 10 find the area of a sector inside a central angle of 20 degree in a circle of radius 7 meter we will find area r is 7 meter theta is equal to 20 degree so it will be converted into radian so 20 multiplied by pi by 180 so it means that it will be converted so 0 0 are cancel 2 1s are 2 2 9s are 18 so pi by 9 so area of a sector is equal to 1 by 2 r square theta 1 by 2 the value of r is 7 so it means that 7 multiplied by 7 which is 49 and theta is pi by 9 so 49 pi divided by 18 meter square so 49 multiplied by 22 by 7 so the uh, value of pi is 22 by 7 so 20 uh, 77 divided by 9 after simplification so answer is 8.55 meter square question number 13 the area of a sector with a central angle theta in a circle of radius 2 meter is 10 square meter find theta in radians so r is 2 meter area is equal to 10 meter square and we will find theta so we know that area of a sector is 1 by 2 r square theta area of a sector is 10 is equal to 1 by 2 r is 2 so 2 square and theta we will find the value of theta so 10 is equal to 2 theta because 2 or 2 cancel so 2 theta so divided 10 on both side it means theta is equal to 10 by 2 theta is equal to 5 radians